What's good, BT gang? We back with another banger, man. As you can see we got this Amethyst Marvin Bagley the third right here before us. But before we get to him, thank y'all so so much for 803 subscribers, man. We just hit 800 last night on stream, and I appreciate y'all so so much. But let's try to hit 805 by the end of the week, and the only way we're gonna do that is if we hit that like and subscribe button, and hit that notification bell, so you know every time your boy goes live or post. I appreciate y'all so so much. Thank y'all in advance. But we got this Amethyst Marvin Bagley, and Marvin Bagley is known to be the best budget beast center every single year when he comes out in 2k so we're gonna check out to see if that remains the same we got a 94 offense a 92 defense 611 from duke 86 driving layer with an 86 mid-range shot an 84 three-point shot 90 standing and driving dunk 86 ball handle on the center is huge at this stage in the game we got an 84 block 80 steals 75 perimeter defense with an 84 interior defense and we got 88 offensive rebounding with a 90 defensive rebounding. Then we got an 85 speed with a 79 speed of ball, 85 acceleration with an 86 vertical, 84 strength, and 82 lateral quickness. So he looks like a Swiss Army knife. He can do it all at that center or power forward position, which is very valuable at this stage of the game. But we got one half badge, which is put back balls. Then we got 34 goals, catch and shoot, corner specialist, acrobat, brick wall, post bank technician, drop stepper, live city finisher, rim protector, chase down artist, box, clamps. Interceptor, Intimidator, Posterizer, Rebound Chaser, Post Lockdown, Back Down Punisher, Rise Up, Pro Touch, Downhill, Set Shooter, Quick First Step. With that 86 ball handle, is going to be crazy. Green Machine, Hot Zone Hunter, Bullet Passer, Limitless Takeoff, and Grace Under Pressure. So yeah, this dude looking good. And I literally picked this dude up from 1.5K. So just keep that in mind. If y'all budget players are just starting a game out, Marvin Bagley should be one of your first choices when you're making your team. But let's go ahead and slide him in to see if he... Has any hot zones or anything for us? He does have two hot zones in the corner, which is kind of promising for us. You know, he kind of, he might need those. But that release, I'm not sure how I feel about that. It's kind of long. It's a longer, slower release, it seems like, because that, that's early, but I am holding it. I guess that's, you know, how long you got to hold it. But, yeah, it's not bad. It's actually, it's not the fastest release, but once you get down, you know, get it down, it's definitely going to be green, as you can see. I ran, like, three in a row until this one. But, yeah, it should be a decent release. You know, Marvin Bagley, he's not known for his shooting. He should be moving pretty decent. But, you know, shooting is not his strong point. But he can do it, as you can see. But let's, let's go ahead and see how he feels going to the basket with the stick dunk first. Okay, Marvin. Okay, nice little easy dunk right there. That's a quick, nice one. It shouldn't get blocked as much. Hey, he can move a little bit. I ain't going to lie. That 86 ball handle, he can move a little, y'all. If y'all can see this. He can move a little bit, man. I'm not going to lie, bro. But let's check out the full court six, my man Marvin Bagley. He is going to get tired, though, because I bet his stamina is low. It is crap. But let's check out his full court six. Not the best behind the back, but it's simple. He keeps you in the same direction, so it should be pretty, pretty fine. But he can move a little bit, man. It's nice to see big men starting to get that love, that quick first step, that 86 ball handle. It's almost that time of the year, bro. We're going to start getting on crazy cards, bro. But let's go ahead and uh, let's green one more three, and let's get to the gameplay. Marvin Bagley seems to be a great, great option, especially for budget guys just starting the game out. He should have no problems with this card, bro. But how y'all feel about these packs, man? These guaranteed Opal packs. Y'all feel like that's good for the game? I feel like it's bad. Y'all let me know down in the comment section. Let's go out here. Let's get uh, let's get Bob Sarah out here, bro. That's my guy. Bob Sarah's my guy. Let's go ahead and slide in. My man, Marvin Bagley Jr. third. I said Jr. Marvin Bagley the third, And Chris Middleton. Let's see if we can get a W in these sweaty triple threat online streets, man. But yeah, I don't know how I feel about these packs. Y'all let me know, bro. I mean... It's like DBG said, to take away the, the gambling aspect, but it does add a paywall to an extent, you know, to every, you know, you know, my team player out there. So just keep that in mind. But we're going to see how, how it affects the market and how it affects the 2K community as a whole. But hopefully we get into a game decently right here, as we do. Hopefully Marvin Bagley has to, you know, play some good defense here and lock down whoever he's guarding across from him. Come on, 2K. Let's see who we get. Let's see who we get. Let's see who we get, man. Let's see who we get. All right, we're in the game. Who we got here? Vanderbilt and Kukoc. It's probably, we're probably going to be on Kukoc. Kukoc is 6'10", but I don't know how tall Vanderbilt is. I think we're going to be on Kukoc. That's a good matchup for Marvin Bagley. Oh, Fred got the speed, though. Fred has the speed, bro. Coming out the gate. Look at Chris Middleton with the good help right there, though. I see if Marvin can get open over here in this corner. Dang, bro, why are you helping so hard? Marvin, that's not a good finish. But my man, Bob Sir. Ah! Dude is helping so much, bro. Curtis Middleton's not getting that board over Vanderbilt. Look at Bob Sir doing everything right. You got any post game? Oh, good block. Good block. All right, my man's playing good defense so far. Okay. He's sweating with that Vanderbilt, bro. He got to get rebounds with him, so. 
probably what it is. Oh, yeah, he's blowing past Tony Kukoc with ease, man. I'm telling y'all, that little quick first step edge is going to be huge for Marvin Bagley. We were struggling at first, but I think we got it now. We can't let Fred dance on us. Come on, Bob. Have some pride, Bob. Ah, uh, he got past us. That's a good move. Fred Van Vliet is a good card, man. Definitely type into him as well. Oh, yeah, he's little. This dude was actually playing defense. Like He's playing, like, decent defense actually, at that. Look at Marvin. He just has that burst, bro. He has that burst to him. I don't know what it is. He just has that burst. That quick first step, that ball handling definitely can help that, but and you can just feel it in him. Pause. <laughs> hands, hands, hands. Ah, uh, that's a good shot for Cool Coach. He misses, though. Bagley on the boards. Can we push it a little bit here? Let's see if we can get a dime, my man. Bob Sir under the basket on the smaller Fred Van Vliet. Marvin Bagley leading the break right there. That's what he's going to be able to do, man. Go coast to coast and make the right play for your team. Oh, yeah. Good defense. Look at him. Marvin Bagley switching on Fred Van Vliet and getting the board once again. Let's see if he can run his points in the cheese right here. Oh, Vanderbilt got a great steal. Oh, good pass to my man Fred out there. That's a good shot, bro. Kudos to this dude. He's playing good. He's playing well right now. Hey, Marvin. Hey, Marvin. Hey, Marvin. Let's go, man. Mar he's a beast, y'all. He's a beast, man. He's like a, a 1.5K point center. He's literally a point center. Good block. I know you going to have to shoot it, bro. I was just playing the percentages right there. If you play all ball, I can cook with Marvin Bagley. That's the thing. Oh, this dude almost got a steal. He's going to keep all balling me with Kukos, man. My first two gameplays of the day, I got all balled in both, man. Shows how OP it is. Go ahead, Bagley. Go ahead, Bagley. Ah, uh, he got a little contest. Ah, uh, that's fine. I can't do much with the off ball. Ah, oh, that's a steal. Come on. I know you're trying to score with Van Vliet, bro. Yep. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. Look at Chris Middleton. Good board. Oh, Vanderbilt, you're not getting that stick. Oh, oh, he found me, though. Oh, and one, Marvin Bagley. Let's go, y'all. See what see what I'm saying? Marvin Bagley out here getting four-point plays, man. Oh, Chris, you got to steal that, bro. That's good, D. Oh, my goodness. He just bailed me, so he can bail him, too, I guess. That's fine. Why you got to See, I would respect this dude, but he off-balling me. Like, come on, bro. It don't got to be this way, man. Easy done for Bob Sir. You know, just to keep him honest. God, Bob Sir has Hall of Fame quick first step. I didn't even know that. It's crazy to think about. It didn't, this game did not have to go this way, bro. You did not have to off on me. Yep. 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 Yep, get that out. Ah, uh, he got the little rebound. That's fine. Bagley's playing really well though. I love this card so far. He's not he's not better than Jaron Jackson or anything like that. But he's definitely as we draw the foul right there, he's definitely good though. He's, he can move a little bit too with the ball. We haven't really seen a budget center that can do this yet, so promising to see this from 2K so early. Look at Vanderbilt. Stop jumping. Paint mash right there. Paint mash to death. Eleven points, two rebounds, and two assists for Bagley, man. And he has glass tape. So we're going to see how that helps him on the boards. Hopefully, we grab this one, and we will. Let's run the break. Run the break. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. Easy. Easy. Easy for Marvin Bagley right there down the lane. He, we're cooking now. I think this dude is getting the picture now. He's getting the picture. Yep. We know the pullback cheese. We know all of that, man. Get that out. Oh, they called a foul on that. Are you serious? When did Marvin touch him? Did Marvin touch him at all? Give me that steal, bro. Come here, Tony. Come here, Tony. Come here. And we we big down here. We're going to fight. We're going to fight. We're going to fight. We're going to fight, y'all. We're going to fight. <laughs> That's funny. 
That's fine. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Bob Sir is not going like that. And one easy lay. Man, Marvin Bagley, he's a little body center, but as you can see, he can bang a little bit. He was banging on there with Vanderbilt and Tony Kukoc. Yep. Stay there. That's not going down. Can't get the board, though. All right, Marvin. Let's see what you can do on Freddy. See what you can do on Freddy. That out, Bob. Come on. Yeah, this dude, he, he knows what it is. He knows what it is, man. Bob Sir is such a good point guard. Still to this day, day and age, bro. No, sir. Run with us, Marvin. That's Dot, Dot Chris Middleton. Easy shot, man. Marvin Bagley, I'm telling y'all, bro. He is that point center that you need. If you like playing with point centers, bro, Marvin Bagley is going to be your guy, man. The only thing about him is his jump shot is a little bit slow, but I'm telling y'all, it's slow, but it's green, man. Once you learn that jump shot, you should be totally fine. And even though he's only like 6'10", and he looks like he has a skinny player build, he can bang, as you can see. And he can hit shots, and he can lead your break. He can rebound. He can do it all, man. So, honestly, I give him an 8 point, you know, 6 out of 10. It's just something about him that's, like, holding him back just a little bit. But for a budget center, man, he's perfect, man. He's... I don't know. He's him and Evan Mobley. I'll say he's better than Evan Mobley by a little bit because he does come a quick first step. But him and Evan Mobley is definitely a discussion. They're both like pretty similar tier type of players. So if you like Evan Mobley, definitely get his card a try, man. But if y'all enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button, man. I ain't gonna say nothing more and I ain't gonna say nothing less. Y'all stay blessed. Peace.